Hey guys, it's Wired Chick and welcome back to Resident Evil. So today I have quite a big to-do list of what I want to get done. I've been reading your guys' comments and I love that you guys are kind of giving me these little pushes in the right direction just to kind of jog my thought process. So I feel like I have a pretty good mental note of what I want to get done today. And the first and main priority is I need to do a cleanup before I unlock any new areas. So before I realized that item boxes actually transferred items between them, I would go into rooms and kind of make note of what was in there, but I left the items. So what I think I'm going to do is actually head back up to the item box room and kind of do a little bit of a minimalist build and start collecting all of these items. So I can't remember how I left my inventory off. Oh, actually, this is a very minimal build. I don't even have any herbs on me, so I should probably grab some herbs first, actually. I think there were some outside here. I'm not actually really that sure, but I figure we could pop out here. I don't think there's any zombies over here. And the shotgun shells are out here, so yeah, this is probably a good idea. I'll just switch to the handgun, I think, just in case any zombies do show up because apparently the more time you kind of spend playing the game things start to change so I need to be prepared for that I think. Okay, actually everything looks pretty good over here. Yes, we're gonna take those. Okay, I'm gonna actually load it up now as well. Oh, I can only have six or seven. Wait, there's only six in there? Oh my goodness! I have been going through shotgun shells like it was nothing. I didn't realize there was nothing even in there. Okay, well, I think that's it for out here. I should probably grab myself a herb before I head back to the item box. Actually, no, I don't think it's too much of a dangerous route to get here to there, so... We'll just make a run for it and hope nothing bad happens. Hopefully nothing shows up. I think we need to get to the upstairs dining room area. I think that's right over here. Yes, okay. It was so funny because in the last episode when I got attacked by the dogs at the end, I actually originally thought I was going through the, <laughs> the dining room door. Apparently I opened the freaking front door and that is where all the dogs came in from. Alright guys, I'm just doing a little bit of inventory management here. So I'm actually going to take this first aid spray since we don't have any herbs and I also just don't want to take any chances. Um, I just put the magazines away as well as the ink ribbons so we can just worry about that when we want to save. So just no more saving in the dining room. And also this wooden mount, I'm going to take this because this is so obscure but apparently by the fireplace that I lit up by the other item box room that we're gonna head to now. Above it was a picture and it apparently is a map. And when I went back to watch that part of the video, I was like, oh my gosh, that looks exactly like a map. I mean, it's just how would you know that this thing, this this wooden plaque would you'd have to use it to get a map. Like it just it's so ridiculous. That's the last thing I expected it to be used for, but you know, this is just why I'm so thankful to have you guys lending me a hand, should I say. So, we're gonna head back there, um, since there's a ton of doors in that hallway. I feel like we're gonna find a lot of items. There's a lot of herbs in that area as well, so I'm just gonna grab everything. Maybe we can... Yeah, what we're gonna do is see what the quickest route to get to those areas is. Because I think that this item box is very quick to get to, but the other one might take... <laughs> that camera angle struggle might be a little bit more difficult, so... Yeah, it's on the first floor. I think I need to head back downstairs then. And we'll just kind of see what the quickest ways to get back to those areas are. Yeah, I think it was back... Yeah, 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 okay, I think I remember. I'm replaying my previous episode in my head. Also, 
I know you guys have been leaving me tons and tons of comments, but I just want to remind you guys that I actually am going to be filming two videos at a time. Um, I just don't want you guys to get offended if you leave me a comment on my Monday episode and if I completely ignore it for the Thursday one. Just just please don't get upset because I filmed two at a time so there's no way for me to implement them because it's already filmed. So today I've read up your comments, I think I'm pretty caught up so I'm gonna do my best to follow your guys' tips. But the combat, for example, that's just one thing that you guys gave me. Oh, no, this is not where I thought we were. This is not where I thought we were. How do I get there? Okay, we gotta follow this little hallway. <laughs> yeah, with this combat, it's kind of, kind of difficult. But apparently there's an auto-aim feature, which... I didn't realize why I hate these camera angles. Oh my goodness. There's apparently an auto-aim feature that helps you to detect if there's any threats or something like that. Um, so if you walk into a room and you put on your auto-aim, it'll kind of go to if there's a zombie in front of you. Kind of, It's kind of like a way to get by these strange camera angles. This is also not where I thought we were. Is this the item box room? Okay. Oh, this area is apparently locked too. Did I check these ones already? I think I may have checked this one already. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> I just saw some arms! Wow, guys, I'm not gonna do well at this game. I am not gonna do well at this game at all. <gasps> Scared by the zombies. Okay, let's go back out because <laughs> oh gosh, sorry, I'm a chicken. Um, another also really confusing thing in my opinion is when it comes to these dead zombies. So you guys were telling me if you see pooling of the blood, if you stab them, if you blow off their head, if you burn them, they're dead. But I've also been hearing that they can come back to life and apparently they're more aggressive and things like that, but I, I just don't really get how that works yet. Um, I feel like every time they've gotten up again, they haven't been that bad, so I don't know. I, I guess those are one of those things that, we'll, you know, once I play through it a bit more, we'll see. Maybe we'll, we'll kind of figure out everything today. I have a lot of questions now, so... There's a map of the mansion second floor. Take it, yes! <laughs> oh my goodness, this place just keeps getting bigger. Wow, okay, that is really good. Yeah, I would have never, never thought to do that. But it does look like a map now that I think about it. Okay, let's grab both of these herbs while we're here. And then I don't think we have to come back until we get another key or something like that. Okay, this might be a little bit choppy because of the fact that I'm just going to be kind of going back and forth through areas, but I think it's just good to be able to get familiar with the mansion. I mean, a lot of you guys, I think, have already played this probably multiple times too, so you're probably just going to be bored, but <laughs> maybe some exciting things will happen. Alright, what was this room? This one's still in progress. Yes, oh, yes, oh my gosh, I totally forgot if it's red... That means you haven't got all the items, so we'll just head back to the red rooms. Alright, what was here? Oh, 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 there's- okay. Will you take the handgun magazine? Yes, I will. A chessboard card from Ivory. The game appears to have ended in a checkmate. I don't really know anything about chess, so <laughs> I don't really know what that means. We take the dog whistle. Okay. You guys were, yes, you guys were talking about the dog whistle <laughs> and how I, how I need to pick that up. Okay, a crumpled memo. Today, Sir Spencer told me to hide something where no one could find it. Well, I had this idea. I figured if I could somehow have it protected by a dangerous animal, like the vicious canine that live here, no one would be able to get near it. 
As far as I can tell, the mutt is always hanging around the second floor balcony on the west side of the terrace. <laughs> so specific. And he ought to come running at the sound of a dog whistle. This is where you come in. The thing is, I reckon you're the only person that can get near that damn dog without risking a serious mauling. Which means only you can put this collar on him. The object that Sir Spencer wants hidden is concealed inside. You're the only person I can trust with this. Of course, you'll get something out of it as well. Remember that certain item that you've always wanted to get a hold of? Well, in exchange for your services, I just might be able to get it for you. This could work out well for the both of us. John Tolman. Who was this directed towards, though? Huh. I don't know if that was meant for me, you know? Open journal, the pages are blank. Yeah, I think we saw that. What was in this room again? Oh, right. We just came back out here. Okay. So, <laughs> I think it's at the west second balcony. So, maybe we should do that now. If I have to call dogs, I just recently saved. So, <laughs> if anything goes wrong... You know, if we die, it's not that bad. So let's find that balcony. West, second, terrace. Um. Oh, okay, I think it's that red one on the left bottom there. Okay, we're going to be doing a little bit of a run back now. Run back to the main lobby and then out through the balcony. So... I don't know if I should use my shotgun. I just seem to not really have good luck with the dogs. <laughs> Everything went horribly last time, so I, I don't really have high hopes for myself when it comes to killing a dog, but we can hope. Okay. That was easy. This actually might be the quickest way back to an item box then. Actually, they're both pretty quick. Yeah, there's no way I need to carry all those ink ribbons on me because a save a save typewriter is really not that far. Okay, is this the balcony? That is not the balcony. This one. Yeah, I think this is the balcony. Okay. <laughs> God damn it, I gotta ring a freaking dog whistle. This is just oh a watch there not even be an item on it. Okay. I don't know if I- if there's a particular weapon I should use, if it should be my shotgun or my handgun. But now seeing how precious ammo is for the shotgun, I think I might just wing with the handgun. I also don't know if I'm supposed to aim down at the dogs, or if I can just aim straight ahead because it's so weird. All the way up here apparently gets you a headshot. So I don't really know if it matters, but... <laughs> YOLO! You blew the dog whistle. <sighs> All right, let's get it. I hear it. <gasps> Shit, I used. I did it! I did it! I did it! Ah! There's a second dog. There's a fucking second dog. <laughs> Will I be able to evade this one? Will I take the collar? Absolutely. Oh. Bye! Nope. Fuck. Get off me. Yeah, take that. You probably don't need this dog whistle anymore. You are absolutely right. Let's get rid of that shit. I never want to see that again. Okay. <laughs> okay, we're not going to go back out there. I don't think there's any other items out there, actually. Yeah, okay, that one's done. I unfortunately lost a dagger in the process, but we got a collar. <laughs> now let's examine it. Anything funky about this? There's nothing unusual. There's a switch! Will you press it? Okay, we gotta examine this from all different angles, I guess. Yeah, I haven't been examining stuff enough, so... You guys were, uh, <laughs> making sure to let me know to really examine things. A coin was hidden inside the collar. Coin. There's nothing unusual. Oh, 
Oh, it changed into the shape of a key. <gasps> Imitation of a key? Wait, does that mean it... Is it a key or not a key? Okay, look, 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 okay. <laughs> I know I didn't examine my other key, but apparently it was called the sword key. But by looking at this, I think this is the armor key. So all of the doors that said that it had an emblem of an armor engraved into it. I wonder if I could use it. I don't know, it says imitation, so I'm not particularly sure if that means we can use it or not. Let me see. Let's try this one. It's locked. An emblem of armor is carved into the lock. Okay, so it doesn't actually work as the armor key. So, what could it... Oh! 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 Light bulb. I actually think I know what to do with this. Um, I remember my original plan with the sword key was before I discarded it, I wanted to go switch it with the one in the trap. So... I wonder if I could switch this one because it's an imitation. Oh, <laughs> I hope this works. Okay, so I actually think it's down this hallway. Yeah, I think it's down this hallway. And then we can go, oh, we can switch. I, I think this is gonna work, guys. I have a good feeling about this. Wait, actually, this doesn't look like where I was supposed to go. Nope, I think this is the wrong side of the mansion. I think. Oh no, I'm, I'm already getting lost. Was it the second floor? I think it was the second floor. Or was it the first floor? Oh no. This doesn't seem like it was the right way. I could have sworn it was on this side of the mansion, but now that I think about it, it might have actually been on the first floor. Sorry guys, this is gonna be painful to watch, I can already tell you. I'm already just frustrated that I don't remember, but you guys that have probably watched so many playthroughs of this game, are you guys are probably just like, oh my god, this girl is awful. Where would have that broom been? How the heck do I get back to this trap? Emblem of armor. Okay, maybe I maybe I'll just remember all the areas that said emblem of armor. Because when we do get the real armor key, we can go back. Maybe it was over here. No, that's the dining room. Why am I so bad at this? Oh, actually, oh, I know exactly where it is. <laughs> the literal one place in the map I haven't been in so long. We haven't been there since the first episode, so... It's a little bit getting used to everything. Okay. This first door, I think it was. Hopefully. Fingers crossed. <laughs> Yes, it was this room. All right, this man's still dead. Yeah, it's just, I was thinking about this one because I remember getting a confirmed kill, so, and he came up a second time and he didn't seem to be like that much worse, so. <gasps> Holy fuck. <laughs> that scared the shit out of me. <laughs> oh my God, that one never came back to life though. Okay. <laughs> well, there's a problem in that room. We can deal with that later. All right, let me just stand to the side. So in case I'm too slow, I don't get absolutely wrecked. Will you take the mansion key? Yes. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. I know you do your thing. You want to kill me. I have to sit through this whole cutscene. Okay. key. I'm so smart. Honestly, someone probably said that, but I figured this one out myself, so that's all me. <laughs> Everything else, so I need help with because <laughs> I'm not very smart. Okay. 
Let's take a peek at this. Yeah, okay, see, there's a little armor. So now we can go back for all of the... Oh my gosh, we're going to unlock some more area. I really should have done a full cleanup first. What was I thinking? I said I was going to do that, and then I didn't. Okay, well, now... <laughs> we're gonna have even more areas to unlock so i think there's actually a door over here i wonder if that one takes the armor key it's locked emblem of the helmet is carved into the lock okay yeah okay let's oh shoot yeah okay we have a zombie down here that we're gonna have to deal with now and where do i want to go now i feel like i should plan i could go straight ahead through that door or i could go left depending on where he is in the room yeah i'm not really sure maybe we'll just run back to the main lobby because that's just that just feels like the safest area in the game to me because there's nothing really there oh and there's herbs here I should probably take that. Yes, I will take my last, last herb. Where'd he go? Okay, maybe... Maybe he just got up and ran away. He was just like, you know what, I'm done with this shit. Get me out of this mansion. Holy shit, that scared me. This is not where I thought I was going. Okay, actually, speaking of this room, apparently there is something in this room with the crows. I'm not really sure what. It says 100% items, though, so I don't think there is anything here. Wait, what are these? These, like, shackles? What the heck? Okay, actually, I think someone mentioned something about there being shackles on the wall. Why are there shackles on the wall? Oh, and there was a zombie here too, and he's gone. Okay, I don't think I missed any, like, actual items, so in this room. Unless if there's something in the cage, which I don't think there was. I don't know. <laughs> All right, what's this room? Hey, friend. <gasps> what the fuck? <gasps> Holy fuck. Okay. I think I figured it out. <laughs> so fucking stupid i was like how are they more aggressive when they get back up how jesus christ i'm actually an idiot i should have freaking burned them all why didn't i burn them all i'm not going back there wait no but there's wait was that one that just got up one of them too did i just trap myself <laughs> Oh, fuck me. Thank God we haven't made too much progress because I'm probably gonna die. Actually, no, he disappeared, so I don't think he's actually here. Ah! Fuck! Holy shit! Oh! No! Get away from me! <laughs> All right, we are never going down that hallway again. It's not happening. It would. <laughs> what did I trigger? Jesus! Oh my god! I just I need I need a second. I need to just I need to breathe for like a minute. Okay, there was a name for them. You guys said that they were called something, but I can't remember. I'll check it out after this video because I forget what they're called, but there was a specific name for them and... <laughs> 
now we have them. Oh god. So maybe when I got that key, it like triggered. Oh no, does that mean all the zombies I left behind now? Are gonna be like those guys? <laughs> I really hope not because I <laughs> will have a heart attack. <laughs> They were so fucking fast! What the heck? Okay, is this the front door or the dining room? This is the dining room. Yeah, what door did I go out originally? Oh, that's where I went. Okay. Not doing that again. Where the fuck is Barry? I need to tell Barry. Barry's gonna lose his mind. Oh god, what if Barry- what if they got Barry? I gotta find Barry! Wait, what is even our main objective at this point? Wait, isn't it to find Wesker? Aren't we supposed to be looking for Wesker? I just went the wrong way. That actually leads back to the hallway, I'm pretty sure, where we just had that one guy. I'm supposed to go upstairs. <laughs> Guys, I'm seriously just so scared now, I can't even think properly. Well... Let's go back to the item box. We'll put our herbs away. I can't remember where else I've seen a red herb, but maybe... I know you guys said not to mix them, but I just feel like it'd be a good idea to mix them. I might just end up mixing them. Alright, oh shit, no, there was one... God damn it, there was one down here too. Maybe I could try killing him. I guess maybe we could see how difficult they actually are. If they're just really fat... Hmm... Should I sh no, I don't want to waste my shotgun. Okay, we're just gonna YOLO it, and if it just doesn't work, we're just gonna run like hell. <laughs> if I scream again, I'm sorry, because I probably will. Where? Okay. He's dead. Ah! No, he's not! Fuck my life. Fuck me. Fuck. Seeing red. Jesus Christ. Wait, weren't they- they were called like redheads or something. Okay, please, please, just don't do that again. Please don't. Just don't. <sighs> okay, I think that took about the same shot, so for a regular zombie, it's just ten times freaking harder. The fuck? Why is- what the fuck is that? What is going on with that door? I don't know what happened when I picked up this key, but everything just became ten times worse. Am I supposed to open it? Hello! Oh, you're just a regular one. You're nothing. You know what? I'm not even scared of you anymore because I just saw something even worse than you. Okay. <laughs> yeah, maybe we can just avoid that one because I think if you don't kill them, like as long as they don't go down on the floor, they won't like come back as them. I don't know. Okay, let's put these herbs away. Maybe I'll just keep the first aid spray on me for now. Um, oh, actually, I think out on the balcony, where that, that dude just busted through the walls, um, I think he actually came from where there was more herbs, so we can probably head back out there. Alright, I might just keep this handgun magazine on me now because I'm nervous. Oh shit, no, there was a dog out there too, was there? I don't even know, there's so many- No, 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 that was the other balcony. Please ignore my thought process, I don't know what I'm talking about. I wonder if I can knife him. Oh, I put my knife away, but someone challenged me- Ooh, too, Try and knife him. Can I just, like, get by you? Quit 
Nope. Fuck. That was that was stupid. Yeah, just yeah. Fuck, he's gonna come back as one of those freaking things. Nope, he's he's just a regular one. How bad is my health? Caution orange. <sighs> Let's just check what's out here first. Guys, it goes to Wait, that's so strange. I thought it went to caution yellow and then orange. Why is it already at Oh wait, why you use them? No, I don't want to use them. I thought I could just pick them up. I don't know what that means, but I thought there was more herbs somewhere else. No, this isn't where I thought I was. You know, maybe I can just use the first aid spray. Yeah, okay, so that brought it up, I think, two points. So the equivalent to two herbs, I think. Okay, good. This leads right back into the mansion. So now where could I go with that armor key? Okay. <laughs> I'm still flustered. Oh, man, you know what? I'm already seeing. I know exact- I'm pretty sure I know where I have to go, but I don't want to go there. So it's the room beside the dining room where we killed that first zombie that we just saw. That's a redhead now. And there's two locked doors there, and I bet you it's going to be one of those doors. Yeah, I bet you it's going to be one of those. Okay. I'm gonna get back downstairs again. Where, where the fuck is Wesker? Like, honestly, why am I going through all this shit? Me and Barry are looking for him. Honestly, at this point, if Wesker's gone through anything we have, he's probably dead. And just wearing those sunglasses, he probably won't even be able to see shit. So, he's probably dead. Why is it saying that one's locked now? Why is it red? Hold on, let me double check this. No, it's open. Why did why did it go red? Huh. I could have sworn if it was red, it meant it was locked, but maybe I don't maybe I don't fully understand the map yet. Honestly, I don't really fully understand anything yet. Except that you shouldn't leave zombies without burning them. That's that's probably the biggest thing, okay. <laughs> oh, actually, I think in the dining room there was that blue gemstone too, so I should probably pick that up and run it back to the item box. Yeah, there it is. Yeah, I can't possibly think of anything that would take this yet, so we're gonna put that in the, yeah. Oh god, I don't actually know how much damage those guys do, so I don't know if I should actually take a chance, especially having no herbs on me. You know what? He was to the left, I think, so maybe we can make a run for it and just, just go to the go to the right. Or we could shoot him. Or I could shotgun him. You know what? I'm just gonna shotgun him. Because there's a quite a couple doors down there, so I think we're eventually gonna have to go back there. And I should probably kill him. Okay, I'm I'm also probably gonna scream again. Just just warning you. Oh I got his head. Okay, that took two shots, so I should have aimed up right off the bat. <gasps> Look at his nails! What the heck? Those are so long! <laughs> They're like claws! <gasps> oh, he must have like mutated or something. Locked from the other side. Okay. Yeah, yeah, okay. That's that's good. Alright, so now we got that one out of the way, so this area will be clear, hopefully. Alright, where are we now? Do I have yeah, I have this part of the map. Okay. Let's examine. There's something written in the corner of the picture commemorating the completion of the mansion. Oh yeah, they like commissioned like someone to like do it like, you know, they they had all these painters like throughout the throughout the building of it. Oh, what's this? It's like a like a like a bar? 
Wood encounter made of oak, it gives off pleasant aroma like fine wine. There's something sparkling there, though. I will take that ink ribbon. Maybe I don't need to be so stingy with my saves then. Okay, we're gonna equip that again. Yeah, I thought it was like, we weren't gonna get that many, but I, I just, I don't know how long this game is. I don't want to take any chances, you feel? Oh god, the graphics are so bad in this area. It doesn't even look like they changed it <laughs> from 1996. Okay, is there anything else to examine here? Expensive looking grand piano. Ooh. I don't play piano, but every time I see a plan a piano, I always really want to play it. Okay, that's where I came in through. There's something over here. Nope, just the expensive looking piano. Oh okay. I can move this. She put her hands on it. I'm so smart. No, I'm not. <laughs> I'm actually probably really bad at this game. Okay, what's this? Uh, will you take the musical score? Yeah, I got the inventory space for now. Oh shit, I don't have any defense. I cannot fuck up. Alright, let's examine this. What does it say? It's titled Moonlight Sonata. That sounds so familiar. There's gotta be something else with this. Ah, there we go. A section of the music is missing, leaving only the beginning and the end of the music. Missing music. It's called missing music now. Okay. So I guess we got to find the missing music. <laughs> Does this have anything to do with the piano? Can I like play it on the piano? No, okay. Guess we gotta look for missing music. Maybe I could play the piano if I find the missing music. This looks like papers on the floor. Is this not the missing music? Guess not. Okay, I don't think there's anything else in this room. So I guess now we have to just continue looking to see what else the the armor key opens. Is there anything here I can examine? Bro, there's Jack Daniels there! I can freaking tell. I can tell because it's the only modern part of this game. I can see it's a Jack Daniels label. Oh, Capcom, you're so slick. <laughs> okay, now I feel a little bit less stressed knowing that there is no um, one of those guys out here. Wait! Wait. Wait, my friend was in here. Does he turn into one of them? I don't know. I don't really know the science behind these zombies yet, so... I don't know. Where else did we have... Oh, no, no, no. There was a locked door up the right side of the mansion that had an armor emblem that we have to go to. Alright guys, I'm end this episode off here. I know we didn't make as much progress as I wanted to. We didn't get too far into a cleanup, but I feel like I definitely had <laughs> a lot of questions answered about this zombie issue with these new enhanced, uh, very poorly manicured zombies that are marathon runners. <laughs> and also I think I actually might be getting the hang of the combat a little bit better. I think the dogs and the enhanced zombies didn't go as bad as they could have and we're still we're still fine. So <laughs> I think that it all went okay. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm going to continue filming now. So I will see you all in the next video. Bye.